Hello everyone, this is Dragonheart and welcome to my YouTube channel. Welcome to the part 5 of my Carthage campaign. And we're now at war with Syracuse and in the last episode I was able to say Cassentia. So I'm going to double check diplomacy to begin with. Ooh, Serenatia, can I trade with you? Let's have a look. I will be a trade. For your Fail. Nope. Okay, screw them. So we have an army over here, Pride of Mago, even though the general is called Himilcar, which is rather daft, if you may say so. Yeah. Actually I might rename that army because they're going to bug me. They will call you the Pride of Himilcar. Did I spell that right? Himil <laughs> I spelled it wrong. Himilcar. It's got the car bit. Himil oh, that's right. Yeah, that didn't make sense. And I have my nice army over here, Hannibal's 501st which are replenishing at the moment. I have my ships outside, it the Phoenician Wanderers. Lovely, lovely name for ship. Oh, look at this large stack. Well, nearly full stack army, plus supporting navy. Ooh, I don't like the look of that. Let's try and stay clear of that. Ah, yes, Libya. Libya are betraying us. They're at war with us. We are recruiting. Can I recruit anything else here? Nope. It's not good at all. Can I get any mercenaries, I wonder? Nope. Can't afford it because we are skint. Right, let's go over here to Kartuba. Kartuba's oh, finest, nice. huzzah. Right, they have taken Kartuba. Kartuba is actually looking pretty good. We are replenishing. We got, we're got minus 59 at the moment, public order, but we do have plus 5, so just sit there for a turn or two. I think, if I can double check, I think we're okay in the, in the west, in Iberia. We have Nova Carthago at our backs here and here. The Idani, Aravachi, and the Celtiki. They don't like us. They are quite hostile and unfriendly. I do believe I have a non aggression pack with the Celtiki. And I will most probably try to get some trade. I could get trade with the Idani, perhaps. Or a non aggression pack. I'm not interested in anything. Bastards. Right. So that seems to be everything. So I think what I'll probably do now is end turn and see where we end up in this end turn phase. I don't think there's anything else I can do or move. Could move my ships, but I like to keep them close to uh, Cassentia at the moment. So then turn, and we'll see what happens. Oh, look at this character unassigned skill, Hannibal. <gasps> How could I? Right, Hannibal, Hannibal, where are you? Household. Plus one authority with the fleet. Uh, armor, I like the sound of that. Melee, that's good. Authority. Oh, th <laughs> that is stupid. I can have authority twice. Morale for all units, fleet only. Don't want fleet, I want. Uh, against barbarian tribes, that could be handy later campaign. I think I'm just going to go for the armor for now. And zeal, authority, cunning. What we got? We got public order. We'll go for zeal and begin with. We'll end turn. So, interesting first turn. And these episodes at the moment, I'm recording them and then uploading them like a week later. Basically, I'm scheduling a lot of my videos and then Let's Plays at the moment because of the Christmas period. Um, cause I want to, you know, there's loads I want to do over Christmas, spend time with my family, my girlfriend, and everything. So at the moment, I'm just steamrolling my computer at the moment, recording non stop videos Carthage, Sparta, and The Walking Dead. Just doing all three, getting loads of videos done for the Let's Plays. And then my plan is to get uh, these videos scheduled in the new year. Give me a chance then to concentrate properly on my on my channel. But don't worry, there'll be some vlogs coming up on my channel to kind of explain all this. Invasion force lands in Masaili. Oh, what's this? Mission issued. Defeat the army. The Warriors of the Sun, Masaili. Ooh, be interesting, right? Train game, don't care about any of that. So, these bastards want some war with us. Where are they? Oh, God, here they are. Okay, I don't like the look of that. Na 20. 20, oh, sugar. Libya, what have we got? Uh, <laughs> 8 and 3. Thank you very much. Right, are they allied with Libya? Is there any chance? Probably are, knowing them. Let's see, Mesa Ely. They're not allied with anybody. I don't want to fight you. Can I just give you some land? Oh, of course, can't give land in total war in this game. In like a My beggar. fault. Libya. Can you have a ceasefire, please? Be welcome. Just gonna have to destroy all of you then. Oh, I, ch I hate the fact that Rome. Oh, Rome's got Rome back as well. Look at that. It's just not fair, is it? What about the Etruscans? Can I have some sort of allies in the north? Where are you? Oh, 
Oh, we got trade, and we have uh, a green face, which is always nice. Sit, friend, trade, non-aggression pack. Please, please, please. Ah, oh, you. No more. Ugh. I cannot... So irritating when that happens. Right, that's not good at all. Um, what to do? Could go for Brundisium, but then I could get caught between Neapolis and Apollonia. Uh, I want to hold what I've got as well. Right, we need to make it stand. We know uh, we can't lose Carthage. That's obviously going to be my main concern. So we have a uh, one citizen militia, three Libyan hoplites, plus four mob. Mob's going to be useless anyway. Got my war elephants and some Libyan infantry. We're going to need to spam recruitments in this army. Why isn't it letting me recruit? What is going on? What is this sorcery? I don't want to raise force, I want to recruit. Ah, there we go, finally. That was wasteful. Right, Libyan Hoplites. Go for the cheap option. Give me some Peltas. Oh, look at this, money's gone straight away. Got no money at all. But we need to recruit that to help try to defend. I don't exactly want to be... Well, at the moment, Syracuse is just sitting there. They haven't done nothing last turn. I don't think they're going to do an awful lot to me, so I'm fairly safe in Lilibium, but I need to sleep, keep recruiting over here. Can't afford it at the moment. Can't do any mercenaries either, which is a shame, of course. I got my spy. I can't afford anything with my spy either. Can't do much at the moment, can we? Got my ships. Don't want to waste my ships either. There isn't an awful lot I can do. I'm trying to think what the best thing is for me to do at the moment. Could go for Brundisium, perhaps. Would it be wise this early in the campaign? You know what? War is war. We need to get. Can't get any mercenaries either. Hannibal can probably. Uh, in two turns. Oh, I moved him. Oops, I didn't mean to do that. Okay, we're going to war. <laughs> I didn't mean to do that stupid button. Tell you what. I got see I'm too spread out, this is my problem at the moment. Corralis is just there for the take in. Twenty full stack. Mind you, they don't need spearmen and javelin men. I wish I had ballistas. Those Libyan ships are gonna cause I'm gonna have to be consigned to the fact that I'll probably lose Carthage. So forget about Carthage for now, let's concentrate on Iberia, where we do have an army over here. We do have some holdings. I wanna get Carter Dash back as well. From these bastards, the Gate Tuli. I just hope that uh, Nova Carthago don't lose their provinces, otherwise, I am going to be screwed over here. Can't recruit nothing, of course. Could go to Force March. How many turns will it take? One more turn until they fully replenish. Two more turns. I need to wait two turns until I can perhaps make an uh, attempt to go for a different settlement. But at the moment, there's hardly any funds, there's hardly anything I can do. I have to. I mean, I would be okay with losing one or two provinces over here if it meant I had more money and I could rebuild my empire in one location because the thing with Carthage is they're so stretched look at this you've got a settlement here which is part of Africa one on its own you have Corallis one on its own part of Sardinia and Corsica Lilibium which of course is part of Magna Graecia so they're too stretched out to begin with um, and then of course you have one holding over in Iberia so that's the problem with Carthage, you have no control over your empire basically. There's no stability at all. Right, we're gonna end turn I think. There's not much I can do with this turn. See with the dice rolls. We will see what we end up with in this part. And here we are. The Romans have come out to attack me. They have a lot of Rorari. They have some plebs, some levies. Uh, okay, we'll ass we could retreat. That would nullify the garrison. We got some Carthaginian hoplites and Libyan hoplites. Plus, I got my war elephants. I'm gonna go for this. You know what? Carthage doesn't retreat. Carthage fights to the bitter end, and that is exactly what we're gonna do in this campaign. We're gonna fight to the bitter end. Legio, three, Antiqua or Antiqua. Antikia? Oh, I don't know. <laughs> I'm sure somebody up there watching one of my videos knows how to pronounce that. Anti 
Antiqua? Antiqua? Antiqua. It's the third legion anyway. <laughs> Regardless, it's, it's definitely the third legion. And this is definitely a garrison army, right. Oh, this is going to be painful to watch. <laughs> oh, look at the weather effects. Bloody fog as well. Give me the map. There's two roads either side of the map. This is the road over here. A lot of trees I could ambush in. I want to fight in the open though, so I'm going to fight out here. Let's get my hoplites. Group them up. Ba -ba -ba -ba. There will be trouble. To unlock this group together, that way I can just keep them in the same formation. See? Should come in handy. I'm going to have my elite in reserve. Because I'll most probably need them in reserve. Like so. Javelin men. Just uh, bring them up like so. Elephant can go on the flank. Start the battle and I can't even see the enemy. Where are they? And there they are. They're right in front of me. They're going to come to me. I hope they do. I really hope they do come to me. Oh, see? That's just their main army. This is by here. They do have reinforcements coming over here, look. The problem is I'm too far away. Probably. Uh, I could march forward. You know what? Our aim is true. Let's spread these guys. Double time. Advance Get them here. They can hide here. Oblite is ready. Bring the mine line up. Balhamun be praised. He will enjoy this, I hope. Bringing everything up. Bring the elephants up. Fast forward because it's just going to be me marching, which will be quite boring indeed. Bring them up. Here we go. That's what I want. Three javelin men all in the in the marshland, in the bushes. Hiding. That's the main thing. They are hiding. Toggle off skirmish because I don't want them to run away like a bunch of sissies. They're bringing their main army forward now. I'm not so bothered about the main reinforcement army because it's mainly plebs and levies plus a few plus some rorari as well. That doesn't concern me. What concerns me is this main army they brought out. Velites are better than uh, what do you call them? Levies. Hastati are better than rorari, and of course they have some cavalry, which I have to watch out for because I don't have any cavalry at all apart from my elephant which isn't really cavalry so yeah I'm hoping that the AI attacks me that's what I'm waiting for they're gonna form up anyway which is what I want I can see the full army now we can hit them from the flanks when they get near I'll form these guys up then update days already we're actually gonna curve my formation slightly Royal Sons of Carthage. This is me pretending to be Hannibal by organizing some sort of weird line. But I do hope it will work. I do have my reserves, which will punch through. We'll have to punch through. Curve in my formation. Here they come. This is what I want. Soon we will be firing with these. Elephants! Attack on the left flank. Oh, this is going to be this is going to be horrible to watch. Let's bring the javelin men forward quickly. Quick march, quickly, quickly, quickly. Go for the cavalry. Straight away. Spearmen. Again, the phalanx formation. Bring the stronger elements of the line forward. Elephants, Hannibal, switch to attack. Bring Hoplites forward. Threat the Gus. They're actually uh, peppering me with their thingies. You know what I mean. I can't tell if I'm in melee or not. Bring the elephants out. We understand. Elephants doing well. Throw these guys in. Come on. Get your asses in there. I've lost my... 
from my skirmishers, which I'm not surprised to be honest. Oh, Erebans! Attack the Hastati, go for another charge. This is going to be a horrible battle to watch. It's not going to be clean. We may not even win this. Balhamun be praised! But the elephant is what gives me the advantage in this battle. Flank around with these two units. Elephant hit the Rorari, that should slow them down. Bring these units up. Come on, take the skirmishes out. Flank around with these two. Get around. To what? Ignore the plebs, plebs are useless anyway. Here we go, we're routing this unit of Rorari. Libyan Hoplites, oh look at this, levies are shaking, they're coming back. Hannibal, go straight for their general, Triari. I have lost some elephants. Oh, only one. I'm not quite happy with that. I can live with that. Try and get some of these into phalanx, if possible. They're all in the in this big mosh pit now. Look at that. Lovely, lovely mosh pit. Oh, we're routing them. Oh, I think we're going to win this. And it looks like we've won somehow. There we go. <laughs> Victory. You know what? Let's chase them down. Let's kill. Let's get experience for these men. I want to see good experience. This gives me the experience level. Look at this. Hannibal's got two chevrons. Oh, Carthaginian Hoplites. Oh, a couple of units just leveled up. Wise to keep this on. Oh, this is going to be a big, big, big victory now in this campaign. We need this victory. We can go for Brundisium now, I think, and probably take Brundisium. That gives me most of Magna Graecia, apart from Syracuse, of course. If I lose Carthage, I lose Carthage. It doesn't matter. I'm going to fast forward this as well. Just let my elephants run amok. <laughs> Get them leveling up, my beastly war elephants. Hannibal, you have done Carthage so proudly today. It's an honor to fight beside you. You know, I think I can probably, I can probably end this, I think. Pretty happy, I did lose my skirmishers and one or two other units as well. My hoplites, but they can, they can all level up. Bring some of these forward. Huzzah, huzzah, huzzah. Just run them all forward. Try and get them to catch up with them, as many of them as they can. Starty is shattered. And boy, oh boy, that was a great victory. Let's have a look at Hannibal. Very proud of him today. Where is he? There he is. Hannibal. Oh, look at the blood. Let's zoom right into Hannibal. Balhamun be praised. He has done Carthage proud today. But I think I can end this battle, so... End battle, close victory. Oh, look at the kills. Deployed that many, killed that many. Every man got a kill. Lucius Cursor deployed over 2,000, lost. 1,600, nearly 1,700 men, that's fantastic. And all under 10 minutes as well. Very pleased with that. Close victory. Take that, you Roman scum. And you know what? Because they're Roman, I'm going to kill them. Further orders? further orders? i got to watch out now that they don't counter-attack me, which looks like they're heading that way. Ugh, my own Punic Wars, I would have thought. Etruscans. Oh, I'm quite happy that the Etruscans have come in there. Go on, Etruscan. Oh, come on. A man's calling his war, <laughs> not weaklings gossip. Give me the clash of swords. You bastards. Not wrecking tongues. The Aravaki have declared war on me. Bring it on. Looks like we're going to be fighting on multiple fronts yet again. Oh my god. I hate it when this happens. Oh no, the Gaetuli have taken Tingis as well. Oh, and Libya have finally decided to attack me. You know what? I'm going to end the episode there. We'll have the defense of Carthage in the next episode. Hope you've all enjoyed. I've been Dragonheart. Until next time, goodbye.